Shit, you say, um, like, like you just elaborate a little more on that, like, shit, versus, like, now versus back then. Like, most of the people, like, most of the younger motherfuckers, they don't be knowing, like, the history of shit like that, like, as far as, like, the gang coaches and all that. Some motherfuckers just be claiming shit just because my people's from there and all that. Right, right. And shit like that. Like, you say them legendary names and shit like that. Well, you know, everybody, you know, that's really how it starts, for real. Like, like, I... 30 of them is, you know what I'm saying? His mom is dating them, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like him, right? Yeah. So they. You he know, born in, he like, he was born, born in Texas. Yeah, There's yeah. a lot of motherfuckers who just, you know, just, false claim all. Because they popped up here and they started claiming and hanging around it. Yeah, yeah. Shit like that, yeah. yeah it's, it's a lot of that going on because, like we say, social media doing it. Because that's the cool and the not. Like, if you trip off of it, everybody gangster now. Like, everybody got a swag. Like, it ain't no more. Ain't, nobody, ain't no lame, ain't no lame. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> even the one that you know that's lame, he ain't even lame no more. He he's something nice. So yeah, that's killer, man. Clip, like, yeah, 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 you know killing man. Is it's, it's in the video? It's kind of just like a a trendy thing, I should say. Because even little kids, you can see man. little kids on the internet. I think it was some wow. little dude was a. Uh, Got locked up for stealing or something, but I don't think he was really stealing, but he was going off on the police. Oh, yeah, I seen a little bit. Yeah, Yo, he probably like yeah. seven, nine. I'm talking about he was talking that shit, boy. I'm yeah, like, he beat his like, 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 <laughs> <"Twitter." laughs> He on there like, man, I put my hands up and well, well, my shit busting right now. I'm like, yeah, it's a little bitty grown man in the kid body, you know what I mean? She apologized online, too. She did. I ain't see that. I ain't see that. I ain't see that. She straight made him apologize. Man, that's that's good though. That's good. Yeah, the dude's bad as a motherfucker. Yeah, and that's that's another thing. That's that social. All that shit go back to the internet shit. Actually, internet. Yeah, bro. That's like they said. You can't beat the internet. You can't. That shit just comes. Yeah, so that's why it's important to keep your uh, you know, your reputation. Keep your nose clean because once it get out there on the wave, it's there. You hear me? You can't take that shit off. Man, you post that shit. That shit stuck. Well, that shit stuck. So you definitely got to be uh, be careful. And also, I feel like from versus back then to now is people back then were a little more, you know, the morals and the integrity were there. You know what I'm saying? For us, even with the streets, how we, our OGs were showing us how to do shit and how to move versus now they not even really showing them. And by us not, them not growing up being showed when they, End it. They don't even want to listen now. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, they ain't grow they up. Yeah, they go by their own route. Exactly. They like just up. say like how you say the difference. Like you say it's a little I, shit. Just me speaking on my for my experience, it's a little, it's a little more unorganized shit versus how it was back then. Right. Yeah, exactly. Then like you say like it wasn't always like that. I guess when you was growing up either, it just became shit. It wasn't like you know well, they say I from just for me. I'm young, so I'm just hearing motherfuckers say like the color shit. That was right. probably like St. Louis. It was most like posse's and shit like that. It was right. already sets and shit, but the right. like the Bloods, and Crips, and Six right. Deuces and shit like that. That just came about type shit. And then they they didn't congregate like that. Like now you got like for instance the, the, the way the Chicago shit going. You know what I'm saying? You got the Vice Lords, GDs, Mickey Cole. They all hanging one clique yeah. inside of a. Big gang inside of another clip, like it's weird. That's how it is now, though. <laughs> yeah, man. Like, That's how it is now. Yeah, like man, all these gangs and everybody clicking up. But I guess because it's about the money now. One thing yeah, like, yeah, I yeah. can't say about back then versus now is the bag different now. He yeah. said <laughs> the bag different now. You know what I'm saying? Back then it it was like you heard about some niggas getting some money, but I mean, now yeah. like young niggas is getting money, like. Like, y'all yeah, niggas that's in the 20s and 17, 18. Man. And niggas, I be playing with a with some lumber. For yeah, real. Yeah, I be like, doing that. that. We could only dream of having that type of money at that age. You know what I'm saying? Having 1500 two grand. And my era was like, all right, y'all got me a few bucks. Yeah, you up. And y'all dang, spending shit. that on, on a building shoes. You right. know what I'm saying? Like, damn, yeah, the money is definitely a... It's definitely different from back then. I can't say that, man. It's a lot more young millionaires than it was versus in the nineties and the early two thousands. Yeah. But shit, even like even with that, though, I like they like. I'm sure it was a lot of snake shit going on back then, but now they got this term called what they call it back dope. Back dope. Yeah, back dope. There's a lot of that going on because of the mix of gangs and all that shit. Yeah, I think well, there's a lot of older motherfuckers before like the younger generation, like man, they 
Right. They still got, you know, old beefs and shit like man, they probably putting their young niggas on they like, put in front of their young niggas like, man, that name from Wood Wap Wham, so you know Wood Wap, you know. Right, right, yeah. So it's always still that thought in the back of their head, like this name really ain't you know, he ain't really, really my really gang. From, yeah. Right, right. <laughs> it ain't really from my my gang. They so. fucking with each other but at the same time, it's still like that type of, you know. Now that's one thing I kinda don't understand is that like, man, if it's your guy or your friend and you dealt with him for a minute, you know what I'm saying, for you to back doing them. Now back when we was younger, it was going on, but it wasn't as as much. Man, that, that's a term, man. They it coined was, that shit. It was <laughs> rare that yeah. you heard a nigga snake this pot now. It was cause if you did hear it, it was like, damn dude did that. Like <laughs> fuck damn. But now it's common to hear yeah. motherfucker back you be like, damn, it's probably oh damn, that dude whack, man. He whack, man, that's fucked up, bro. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? So that back door shit is definitely at an all time high, man. So I, I don't advise that, man. Like, man, let's go partner you around, man. Stick with him, bro, because you can't do this shit by yourself. Definitely, shit. Like, shit, just when you say you, like, you deal with dad when you was young in the streets, goddamn, and you see what how the culture is now. Like, what advice would you better give, like, the young generation coming up? You know, just, like, advice for, like, how to handle their money, just try to get their stuff about their situation, or just, goddamn, just. You know, leave the shit alone, just, you know, do the right thing, you know, that shit. You know, you know the results of the shit in the long right, run. <laughs> right, 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 most definitely. Shit, I, I just advise brothers to hand together, man, stick together, man, start having more of a brotherhood, because it'll last longer, you know what I'm saying? If you if you stick together and start building your team, it'll, it, it just, and it'd be fun, you know what I'm saying? Seeing the next, seeing the next man win and having longevity for us, like, your money-wise, like, you gotta know your wants from your needs. You know what I'm saying? You gotta you gotta know what wants versus your needs and what's important right now. What's gonna help you move forward? You know what I'm saying? You make a purchase. At least that's how I handle my money. You know what I'm saying? So if I if I buy me a new piece, if I buy me a new little 41 Rolly or something, that's an investment. Yeah, I like the watch, but it's really an investment because if I go broke or anything happens, yeah. <laughs> I can go use this to get back on versus buying something that. It depreciate value when you buy. At least that's my opinion on force with money. You know what I'm saying? Handle it like that. Like for like you say, just investments like that, like real what estate. What you think about for having the money? How you, you know what I'm saying? They say you know, don't be buying stupid stuff like you know, you buy your artillery, but don't be brandishing it no more on Instagram. You know, keep it, keep it low key. Yeah, that's another know. thing. My be too flashy, yeah. man. <laughs> Gotta pop out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Gotta pop out. I mean, I, I, I still had that urge. Man, that's that young nigga shit, though. Yeah, that young nigga shit. Nigga, you know what I'm saying? Hold on, nigga. Don't be on Instagram. Oh, yeah, shit like that. I learned that shit when I was younger, man. Like, police really be on that shit. I never. Yeah. Once police showed me, they, I would get locked up. I had to call the case back then. Police showed me a picture of me. They, I ain't gonna say this. They took right. money on the camera. Right. Right. <laughs> they yeah. showed me a picture. Got them like, man, like, yeah, this you. I'm like, nah, they ain't me. They couldn't tell. You know what I mean? But yeah. right. 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 <laughs> this yeah. is them. I'm like, nah, I ain't never taking no picture with no gun. Really <laughs> you got police more in the office on the computer than in the streets. Yeah, yeah. you yeah. gotta think about this face. They got fake pages. And they put a bad bitch on the picture. Like, Who is this man, bitch? I, I didn't watch niggas <laughs> lies with the police owner and the police saying that they yeah. own her. You yeah. know what I'm saying? And Niggas still doing shit on the live. Don't even. You know, that's another thing. That live, man. That social media. I've seen <laughs> niggas be getting live when you kill. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like putting the three fives on that. Yeah, man. Tell the little emoji G side. I'm like, nigga, if I know what that is, you know the police you know what that is. Nobody stupid, nigga. Be telling on themselves, man. That's yeah. all it is. Yeah, self snitching, man. That's that that's another up, thing. Self snitching. Yeah, yeah. self snitching. That is a big thing, you know. As uh. Knowing how to move, like yeah. they be saying, like, you know what I'm saying? Knowing how to move, you just gotta know how to move. I feel like you could pop out, you could talk your shit, you could do all that, you know what I'm saying? But it's, it's it ain't what you do, it's how you do it, you know what I'm saying? You know, if you're doing it with some taste and some little class and swagger and being humble, I feel like it's, it's all right. But if you being ignorant and got another nigga you beefing and all that, you know what I'm saying? Like the social media beef, you know, we back and forth beefing now. It ain't no more. You know what I'm saying? I ain't getting it. Tag him. Just tag him. Yeah, but yeah, the whole yeah. thing, man. You know what I'm saying? Listen, man. 